from ecovegangal.com and I'm sitting down with Jason Robel who is about to have a television show promoting healthy plant-based eating and I want you to tell everybody all about this. The show is called How to Lift 100 and it's debuting on the Cooking Channel this Sunday, January 6th at 8 p.m. Eastern and 5 p.m. Pacific and it's really, I think, a, a first step in bringing longevity ingredients, simple plant-based recipes and getting people excited about making this food, trying it maybe for the very first time, and introducing a mainstream audience to a more healthful, fun, and exciting way of eating. It's part cooking show, meets sitcom, meets comedy show, meets man on the street going into other restaurants and making healthy longevity versions of their classic recipes. So it's really three concepts in one. So I really think it's, it's packaged in a way, Whitney, that no one's ever really seen before. I think it's super unique. It's super high energy. If you guys have seen my YouTube videos, it's definitely up-tempo music, a lot of quick cuts, and it's only a half hour show. So we're packing actually, is it five or six recipes into wow. a half hour show? Wow. So and all the yeah. recipes are what? what? What type of food are you making on it? It's all plant-based, some cooked, some raw, organic, non-GMO, really high vibe, we're really fun. We're doing a maca malt milkshake, we're doing coconut yogurt with fresh kiwi and fruit. We're doing zucchini pumpkin seed fritters with an orange cilantro chimichurri sauce, a chocolate avocado pudding, zucchini cilantro pumpkin pesto pasta. Oh my god. Those are just a few. I don't want to give it all away. Is it complicated though? Because that's the thing. Is, it, is this hard to make? Because all of that sounds a little like gourmet. Not at all. The, the whole intention here is we're not only empowering people with brand new ingredients like maybe superfoods you've never heard of like maca or cacao, but really familiar ingredients like pumpkin seeds, like cilantro, like oranges that have a whole host of benefits that people get at any kind of grocery store or market. That's but great. the recipe is super quick, super simple, anybody can make them and they're familiar enough, like I said, pasta, pudding, yogurt, that people are gonna go, wow, I can just make a few healthy substitutions with ingredients and it tastes even better than the regular stuff I'm eating and tastes so good, you're gonna wanna share it with your family, your friends. But you don't have to be, be on a plant-based diet to enjoy this food. I mean, this food is something that anybody can incorporate into their life, yeah. whether or not they wanna go plant-based. They can um, just add this in for healthy options on the side in addition to. Um, it's especially great because it's happening in January. Yeah. Start the new year. Exactly. You can start eating healthy, incorporate more healthy foods. That's, that's amazing. Yeah, and that's, that's basically it. We want to support you guys in having the means to kick off your new year in a super healthy way. Again, just by making a few healthy substitutions. Maybe changing out the sugar you're using. Maybe changing out the salt. Adding a few new longevity ingredients and you're gonna feel the benefits. Now, yeah. would you say, since the show is called How to Live to 100, mm -hmm. what, why is it called that? I mean, are people actually gonna be able to live to 100 eating this diet? Do they want to? <laughs> that, well, that's the thing, is I think eating this way and having so much fun and feeling how energized and how healthy, how much your skin is glowing, just how much vibrance you how feel. How much more sex you're having, right? There's a big sex aspect to the show, that, that, Well, that part of the component <laughs> is, is definitely um, showing people how to eat for better lovemaking, how to eat for more energy, how to eat for better sleep. And really, again, changing those tiny, tiny little ingredients that, of course, in a cumulative aspect, when people start making those small changes and start feeling the benefits, they go, wow, I am having better time between the sheets and I am sleeping more soundly and I do have more energy throughout my work day. I'm not crashing at 4 p.m. anymore needing a, needing a nap. And when people start paying attention to those things, they want to live to another. It's like you want to live <laughs> as long as possible. What if they don't have, you know, cable or something? Yeah. What if they don't have a cooking channel? Yeah. So watch of online. Of course. Yeah. So there's going to be web-only exclusive clips coming on this week, you guys. This weekend, go to cookingchannel.tv.com. But if you do have cable, Direct TV, or Dish Network, you can find Cooking Channel there. And if you haven't upgraded your service yet, I highly recommend it. I'm worth the extra 20 bucks a month. <laughs> I am. And hey, you know what? Why don't make a party out of it? You can go to friends or family members' house. Just mm. put a note out on social network, Facebook, emails, whatever. Totally. Have a party. Watch it all together. I'm sure somebody has a cooking channel. And dig this. The recipes from the show, you guys, are already on the cooking channel website. So you could make the recipes from the show yeah. and have there the recipes go. at the viewing party. Yep, yep. I'm Fun. just saying. And you know what? It's all about incorporating your friends and family in because that's what makes being healthy a lot easier. 
And speaking of which, it's really important to share this. So you know, share this video, share photos, tell people about it because we want more programming like this on television. It's amazing. He's actually one of the very first that's got, getting a channel like this with healthy plant-based food on yeah. it. So it's a really big deal. And if you want more of it, share, share, share so that you can pave the way for more people to have their own TV series. Share on Twitter. Use the hashtag HowToLive2100. Definitely tag the cooking channel. They're out there in a big way. We want to let them know how much we love this, how much we love not only the idea, but this kind of programming. So if you want to, you guys can actually email Cooking Channel and Food Network and let them know, but the most important thing is that you share on social media. Post this on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and just share, 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 like you said. Share. Oh, <laughs> share. Share. That was a bad one. <laughs> that was really bad. You know, share. You fucking turn back time. Ooh, maybe we could have share on the show. And she could sing that? Because if we could turn back time, right? Because it's like living to 100 but looking like a 70-year-old. True, true. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like yep. Bernardo Lapayo. The 111 year old vegan? Wow. Yeah, you guys have look to at link that. to that video. Link to that video. Fact, Check that out. Click, click right here. Yep. We'll put a little video yep. 111 there. year old vegan. That's yeah. awesome. Picking up 60 year old chicks. Nice. That's how he rolls. Well, um, if you want more information, you can go to Jason's website, which is jasonrobel.com. That's Jason W R O B as in baby. E L dot com. <laughs> And he's got the YouTube channel, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. He's not on Pinterest yet, but I'm going to get him on I there. am on Pinterest. And I I've just neglected it. Oh, okay. Neglecting. Well, I'm on Pinterest. I'm on all those as well. So if you want information, we've got all of that for you. You go vegan gal, Jason. And uh, visit, like you said, the cooking channel site. All right, well, thanks so much for watching, everyone. And to spread the word. Let's get excited about this. Congratulations. Thanks for Cheers. being here today. Cheers to thanks, that. Thanks, Whitney. Have, I hope all, all of you are happy in a having a very healthy, happy 2013 so far. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.